guys, uh, so just a quick one today. One of the things that we picked up at Expo uh, was from War Paint Figures. The booth just behind us, some of you who watched the show will already have heard. Turns out this guy used to play American football back when Wally Mike was a young and beautiful fella. Um, he does a number of things on his website. I'm going to try and get him on the live show and talk about them. But I've been looking for some scenery for jungle stuff, for use in Warhammer, but also a kind of 54 mil. So it needs to be quite big. Looking at using some of those much bigger World War II figures. And I think it was a pack, so I thought we'd have a quick look. I've already cut it open, so there'll be no bleeding on camera. Uh, it is nicely packed inside. I think this retails for about £51. This is the Jungle Mini Starter Pack. It does a range of these. So uh, you'll have seen a lot of this kind of stuff. A number of people, but I got them. It's all very sort of, if you've seen Mel Bose's stuff, it is kind of, uh, you can see the inspiration of that. Um, but you have to remember with some of these things is, you know, the, the materials that they're made of, although they might be quite cheap, there's a lot of labour goes into this. And that's my problem. Um, but he isn't, he told us he doesn't use fish tank stuff because it's not necessarily repeatable. So, re, re, you know, you can't source it all the time. Um, although it is obviously plastic plants. So there's quite a lot of stuff in here. I thought it was just going to be three or four big pieces. And we're going up in size. And I'm beginning to wonder if I'm ever going to get all this back in the box. Ah. So, very nice. Lost a bit on the floor. So, oh, it's got his stickers on the bottom, look. So, look, it feels like it's got, it's on an MDF or a plywood base. What I liked about it is that it's built up. A lot of this stuff that you'll see that's been, that people have manufactured, it's all flat. And when it's all flat, you, you kind of jungle board looks very weird you need some some of that that's going to give you that line of sight blocking and moving that i think is so important on a war game um oh that's a bit come off there because i pulled it from the top rather than the base so just putting this out on the table we'll get you some pictures of the full contents of this uh as we go where's that uh, in a moment so this just put down looks like enough for about a three by three board as a starting point. You can buy some of these pieces separately or packs of the smaller bits, more of the bigger pieces. And I think it looks, I think it looks great. It looks very hard wearing. Uh, some of the bits are coming off, which is inevitable. I think when you've got something as, as loose leaf as that, um, which is why I build my boards with lip. <laughs> because some things will inevitably come off from your scenery. So there's five, five more substantial pieces, which are four to six inches long, and then a variety of smaller pieces for you to scatter throughout the board. But if you're looking to get yourself a jungle board, you don't want to spend a huge amount of time making it yourself. I think this looks like a decent place to start. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you enjoy our content, like the video, maybe leave us a comment. Thank you.